Welcome to Stock Invest YouTube channel and this stock report for Meta Platforms. The report was first published on our website January 31, 2022, but this is a more detailed version which also includes some fundamental data you need to know. In this 7 to 10 minute long video we give you the information you need to know about Meta Platforms for the upcoming trading day on Tuesday 1st, like support and resistance levels, signals, chart analysis, price to earnings ratios, and possible trading levels. Make sure you watch the entire report so you don't miss out on some key information needed for your trading. Please remember to subscribe so we can continue to grow and give you these free videos. Make sure to hit like and notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new video. Now just sit back, relax, listen and watch the screen as we will show you some interesting data as we move along with the report. In this section you will get some information about the current Meta Platform's performance to better understand the where the stock is right now. In our systems, the Meta Platform stock currently holds a minus 1.948 score, and our system has ranked Meta Platform sell candidate since January 25, 2022. In this period the stock has so far done better than what our systems expected and had a gain of 4.37%. This is an average return of 0.87% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for Meta Platforms our last headline reads, Meta Platforms Incorporated stock price ended on $313.26 on Monday after gaining 3.83%. The Meta Platforms Incorporated stock price gained 3.83% on the last trading day, Monday, January 31, 2022, rising from $301.71 to $313.26, and has now gained four days in a row. It will be exciting to see whether it manages to continue gaining or take a minor break for the next few days. During the day the stock fluctuated 4.83% from a day low at $299.32 to a day high of $313.79. The price has been going up and down for this period, and there has been a minus 5.62% loss for the last two weeks. Volume fell on the last day by minus 253,000 shares, and in total, 21 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $6.73 billion. You should take into consideration that falling volume on higher prices causes divergence and may be an early warning about possible changes over the next couple of days. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $384.33, and the lowest price was $253.50. Right now the price is 18.49%, or $71.07, .07, below 52-week high at $384.33, which also is all-time high for the stock. The Meta Platform's Stock Trends, Predictions and Analyst Ratings Soon we will give you the analyst ratings for the stock, but first the trends. The stock lies in the middle of a wide and falling trend in the short term and further fall within the trend is signaled. The current three-month trend indicates a possible minus 6.12% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 11.70% and 1.63%. The 12-month trend it indicates a 17.15% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between 10.68% and 52.15%. This equals a price between $346.72 and $476.62 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets On Thursday, January 20, 2022 UBS Group set target to $440. On Tuesday, January 18, 2022 JP Morgan Chase & Company set target to $385. On Tuesday, January 4, 2022 Jefferies Financial Group set target to $420. On Wednesday, December 29, 2021 Jefferies Financial Group set target to $420. On Monday, December 6, 2021 HSBC set target to $300. From analysts Meta Platform stock received a general buy rating. The analysts give P.E. ratio a strong buy and price to book a strong buy rating. For the return on investment the analysts give the Meta Platform's stock a neutral rating. In this section, we will give you some information about signals found for Meta Platforms. We will start with the general picture before we move on some of the most famous indicators and signals that will give you a deeper and better understanding of the trading possibilities in the stock. 
There are mixed signals in the stock today. The Meta Platform's incorporated stock holds a buy signal from the short-term moving average. At the same time, however, the long-term average holds a general sell signal. Since the long-term average is above the short-term average there is a general sell signal in the stock giving a more negative forecast for the stock. On further gains, the stock will meet resistance from the long-term moving average at $326.80. On a fall, the stock will find some support from the short-term average at $302.32. A breakup through the long-term average will give another buy signal, while a fall below the short-term average will add another sell signal and strengthen the general signal. Furthermore, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. A buy signal was issued from a pivot bottom point on Wednesday, January 26, 2022, and so far it has risen 6.32%. Further rise is indicated until a new top pivot has been found. Volume fell during the last trading day despite gaining prices. This causes a divergence between volume and price and it may be an early warning. The stock should be watched closely. The stock had a golden star signal on Tuesday, February 9, 2021 in the long-term chart. Golden star signal is when the short-term moving average, the long-term moving average, and price line meet in a special combination. This combination is very rare and often followed by long and strong gains for the stock in question. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence holds a sell signal. Pivots gave a buy signal four days ago. Bollinger gave a buy signal three days ago. The short-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a buy signal two days ago. The long-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a sell signal 13 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages in the three-month chart gave a buy signal 14 days. If we look at the 12-month chart we see, short moving average gave a buy signal 2 days ago. The long-term moving average gave a sell signal 24 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages gave a buy signal 84 days. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for Meta Platforms Meta Platforms Incorporated find support from accumulated volume at $310.60 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock has average movements during the day and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the stock moved $14.47 between high and low, or 4.83%. For the last week, the stock has had a daily average volatility of 3.81%. The stock has a beta of 1.35. This tells us that Meta Platforms is 0.35 times more volatile than the market. Let us have a look at some fundamental data you should be aware of before we tell you some possible good trading levels for Meta Platforms. The price to earnings ratio, P-E ratio, is the ratio for valuing a company that measures its current share price relative to its per share earnings. Meta Platforms currently has a price earning ratio of 21.36. This is a relatively normal price to earnings ratio and often seen in business with long track record or predictable revenues. Next upcoming earnings report for Q4 2021 is expect to be released February 02, 2022. The consensus among the analysts are $3.84. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, Meta Platforms meets first resistance at $328.08. If you do not hold Meta Platforms shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. On a downturn Meta Platforms finds first level of support at $310.60 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. Other levels you should watch based on the famous Fibonacci model are Buy at $303.26, Sell at $314.32, $317.73, $318.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33, $319.33,
$323.26. The average ratings, combined from several analyst sources from Meta Platforms is buy. Here are some of the latest insider trades. On January 25, 2022 Newsted Jennifer made an inside sell of 125 of class a common stock. On January 18, 2022 Newsted Jennifer made an inside sell of 125 of class a common stock. On January 18, 2022 Sue Tony made an inside buy of 3,023 of restricted stock units, RSU, class A. On January 18, 2022 Sue Tony made an inside buy of 389 of restricted stock units, RSU, Class A. On January 11, 2022 Newsted Jennifer made an inside sell of 125 of Class A common stock. Based on the 100 latest insights trades, we have calculated the insider power to be negative at a ratio of minus 22.515. In total, the insiders bought 203,037 and sold 322,645 shares in the last 100 trades. We hold a negative evaluation for this stock, no stop loss set. Is Meta Platforms stock a buy? Meta Platforms Incorporated holds several negative signals, and we believe that it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We, therefore, hold a negative evaluation of this stock. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For the trading on Tuesday 1st we expect Meta Platforms to open down negative $4.47 and start trading at $308.79. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. That's the end of this video, thanks for watching. Leave a comment if you have any questions and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.